Hi, Libra, the Empress. I decided I wanted to do a second reading for you just because. Okay, so we're going to do two for the Empress because you are the Empress, your Highness, Scales, and Justice. Okay. So this is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and the North Node, Libra. We're going to do a reading for you, baby. Okay, let me get the um, sage. Decided to do two for you, the Empress, because you deserve it. And you are your highness, the skills. There's nothing more powerful than justice. Okay? So let's get a message for you. Let's do this for the Empress. What's coming in for Libra, the Empress? This, what's coming in for Libra, the Empress? I decided to do one for you, Libra. Another one for you. All right. We're going to do another one for you, Libra. This is going to be for the 20 and 21 of um, April for Libra, the Empress, the Chariot. Overcoming challenges here. You're the Queen of Wands. Okay, so you're confident you're overcoming challenges. What's this for Libra, the Empress? April 20 and 21 for Libra the Empress. April 20 and 21 for Libra the Empress. You have overcoming challenges here. Yep, sneaky, disloyal, seven of swords. So it could be a cancer that's sneaky or, or disloyal or trying to trap you or set you up, but you're going to overcome this. Someone's trying to put obstacles in your way or fuck you up or do something. Yeah, this could be somebody from the past, six of cups, past, nostalgic, yeah. But I'm getting it's not going to work. Or, or this, this, yeah, Libra, yeah, there you are, Libra. You're so beautiful. Look at you, Empress, your highness. Look at you. You're fucking gorgeous. Some of you could have rainbow color hair, a fruity, fruity pebble hair or something like that. But creation and abundance. There you are, Libra, the third card out. I'm getting something that's very strategic. You know how to, so that, this is giving me strategic energy with the seven of swords because it's not only lying and cheating. It's also a card of being strategic, somebody that could be in the military, somebody that, a hacker. It could be several different things. But the energy that I'm picking up off of this, um, this empress I mean, this seven of swords is being strategic, a plan, figuring something out, overcoming your out, your your challenges. You always will. Libra's rule, talent and creativity, and that's who you are. Nine of wands, the ace of wands. Yeah. So somebody could be upset. Ace of wands and the ace of cups. Wow. Okay, so new opportunities. Yeah, nine of wands. So you're doing something new. You're very creative. And somebody could be annoyed or threatened by that or irritated or whatever. Yeah, we have the nine of wands and the awakening card. Or you could be a little irritated or, or, or something. It, it just depends. Let's see. What's the Empress? The Empress. What is the Empress doing here? Okay. Yeah, the two of pen, balancing and choices. That's you. So you're you're um creating something. Yeah, the ten of swords, painful goodbyes. Yeah. So there so something that could be inconsistent or or something, yeah. The justice ex, um is truths exposed. Yeah, the five of swords, yeah. Uh, manipulation and defeat. So something, yeah, the two of pentacles. So some, something that could be un imbalanced or not enough. You may be walking away or deading that, but this is justice. This is what's supposed to happen. Here you are again, Libra, with the scales. Here you are again. And five of swords. I'm getting like, um, I'm getting like the five of swords and justice is like sweet revenge. Yeah, the sun and the eight of wands. Damn. That's like that's like sweet karma when when the justice and five of swords come out together. That shit is winning. So whatever this this is, this abrupt ending with this inconsistency or on and off or in and out or someone trying to juggle you or lie or cheat or whatever this is or set you up or whatever, it's gonna come to an abrupt end. Okay, ten of swords is painful, but it's it's just, it's quick. All right, it's it's not you know. And then it's over. What's the two? What's what? But let's see what this is. What's the two of pentacles? Two of pentacles. So April 20, um, 
21 and 22. Okay, yeah, we got the Ten of Wands in the reverse, burdened and overwhelmed. So no more feeling burdened or overwhelmed or whatever. Yeah, the Eight of Cups, you're moving on. You're letting something go, moving something, moving on for something. It could be a bit bittersweet, but I feel like it's not like that. Something was inconsistent or back and forth. Your Ten of Wands falling out in the reverse. It says burdened and overwhelmed. You're not going to be that. You're dropping these burdens or you're dropping something that seems to be just too much. And with the Empress, something is supposed to be made comfortable and convenient for you with the Empress. That's a card of comfort, convenient, luxurious, being spoiled, favored, covered. And that's what's just what it is. All right. Okay. We have elevate, move on, and eight of cups. You are moving on. Yeah. So you're letting something go. Just period. In a situation or you're walking away or, you're, or something. Yeah. Let's see. Seven of Pentacles, Eight of Cups that you put time and energy in. Ooh, this came out in, in your uh, first reading as well. If I'm, so go make sure you watch both. But something that you put a little time and effort in, but maybe it was just too inconsistent with the Two of Pentacles or something like that. So yeah, the Seven of Pentacles, delayed progress or replan. So this is just about needing to replan. It's okay. If you have to start over, replan and do something over, it's okay. It's better to have tried and, and failed than to have never tried at all, right? So, um, I don't even feel like it was a fail. I just feel like something just requires too much energy and work. And there's something supposed to be easier for you. So you're moving on. That's why the Ten of Wands is in the reverse. You have the Seven of Cups, Ace of Cups, and the Ace of Wands. You have actually a lot of options. The Seven of Cups is resources. You have a lot of resources, options, and everything coming in. Yeah, the Four of Wands... Yeah, the seven of pentacles. So it's just time to replan, re-strategize here, Libra. And I'm getting you're going to do it because something is not supposed to be too hard. Yeah, confirmation, that horn beeping. Something's not supposed to be too hard for you or way down. Yeah, the star, spiritual renewal and the nine of pentacles. You better go, Libra. Empress, your highness. I love you guys. And I bow to you because you are justice and you bring it for everybody, whether they want it or not we have the page of cups love messages so somebody's apologizing or reaching out to you libra or somebody wants to say something to you maybe have coffee or something like that maybe somebody you're going to those coffee shops where they draw stuff in your cup or hearts or whatever and that's the other two of cups so this is yeah um a union somebody wants a union with you or maybe somebody likes kissing you they want to be with you or something like that all right but yeah we have the two of swords so another two Two, two, two is, is, is also significant, which is visions and balance. So something is really being balanced out in your life for the for you. We have the page of pentacles. Yeah, we have blinded and confused and the two of cups and um, plans for structure. So you're really planning and the queen of wands and the devil with the nine of pentacles. You are so attractive here. Yeah, let's see. What's this? Um, yeah, the six of cups. This is somebody from the past that's coming back in. Yeah, we have the moon card in the reverse. It could be a cancer, fear, hitting, and emotions. Yeah, so somebody is like, maybe somebody's wanting to express this to you, apologize to you, say something to you, a cancer, or somebody, I don't know. Yeah, we have the four of cups, contemplating and bored. Maybe you don't want this offer, though. You just feel like somebody played too many games or they're a liar. Yeah, the justice is showing up for you again, Libra. You're getting justice in the situation. Yeah, the five of cups, um, regret and lonesome. So this could be a Knight of Wands, a Sagittarius that's regretful or feeling lonesome. They want to reconcile with you or they're in love with you with that Two of Cups we saw. They want to apologize. Yeah, the Four of Wands. Two of Cups is showing up again. So this is about love or a union or somebody wanting to. This is someone from the past, a cancer, it possibly could be wanting to come back to you, Libra. Or, yeah, cancer is here heavy, the moon and the chair. Those are both cancer cards. And then here you are, Libra. But I feel like a Cancerian that is wanting to apologize. It could be a fire sign as well. Okay, but we'll see here. Yeah, the two of cups. What's the two of cups? Yeah, the world is showing up. So I feel like that's over, the nine of swords, and someone could be worried about it because somebody was hiding something. Maybe they had hidden motivations or whatever this is. You're like, no, I'm super good. What's the two of cups? I just saw the three of cups. Yeah, the nine of swords. Someone's worried here. They have anxiety. Somebody feels guilty here about this love or what they hid from you or their hidden motives or what they did. Okay, or this is your ass. Or someone's nervous about whatever this is. Yeah, the four of cups. Yeah, the knight of wands. This 
Sagittarius keeps showing up. All right. So it could be a Sagittarius. It doesn't have to be. It could be any sign. What's this for the Empress? What is this for the Empress? What's the Nine of Swords here? Why, why is the guilt here? What's the Nine of Swords? Yeah, because somebody know or somebody's somebody knows you know something or whatever. Yeah, judgment. We have awakening and the four of wands foundations. So I'm getting your home is good here or some kind of so someone is worried about something you're saying or you're announcing. Maybe you're on stage or or you have the six of wands or online or, or you know something. Something's been revealed or it's come out with the moon card in the reverse or whatever. You know something about the past or this or or whatever, okay? But somebody here, they want to apologize or they want to reconcile. Judgment is a card of an awakening or a reconciliation, something coming back from the dead, okay? So with the four of wands, two of wands, this could be a connection, a relationship, a twin flame, one a deep love. I feel like somebody's very attracted to you. They find you to be very beautiful with the creation and abundance. They find you to be very creative here as well. Six of wands is here. So, success, so it says spotlight. So success and recognition and the strength card, gentle and transmit so you could be a leo or have leo placements 11 11 all right so that's um wishes coming true that's the twin flame number that's good luck that's um the heavens that's a lot of things okay but i'm getting like yeah you could be really feeling good here really feeling like you're doing your thing here, really on top with the success and recognition card what is this for the empress what's coming in we have the king of swords yes yeah, strategic and withdrawn that's your energy too, Libra. So you're strategic or you're focused on your career. Or there's this King of Swords that's watching you. They're withdrawn, but they're watching you. They could be, they, they're, they're heavy. You have a three of cup fun times and third party. So I'm definitely wanting to reconcile the hermit wisdom and introspection. This is, could be a um, Virgo. We have two of wands, the devil and the world. Yeah, the knight of pentacles and the seven of cups. So what is this King of Swords doing? We have the Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, this could be something strategic that you're doing regarding your career. Nurturing, resourceful. Okay, you have the Sun card. So we have the Six of Wands and the Sun. So something is successful. You're happy here. Yeah, resourceful. You're resourceful or, or something about your money or making good decisions. Yeah, you're strategic about what you what you need to do as far as you maybe investing money or doing something. We have the Sun card and the Ten of Swords. What's coming out? Yeah, the Four of Cups. So I'm just taking a step back and making sure that whatever you invest in or whatever you do here is that what you really want to do. We have the Five of Swords here, Manipulation and Defeat, the Queen of Swords, Self-Sufficient and Upfront, and then the Justice. Libra, here you are, heavy. Okay, Justice, and it says Truths Exposed. Yeah, you're heavy here. You have the Five of Swords. So there's some kind of hate, jealousy, envy, or passive-aggressive energy that's going on here. All right, there's always something, something here. Okay, what is this for Libra? I thought a card flipped over. Okay, but I guess not. Or we'll, if it did, we'll see, I guess, in a minute. Okay. The Empress, you have the King of Wands. Okay, a leader, strong-willed or something. Yeah, a strong-willed, yes, yeah, greedy. Yeah, somebody, it's a king of wands still holding on to you. This could be somebody that likes to dress or they have tattoos. I mean, likes to work out or they have maybe dress too. And they have tattoos on their chest. So, yeah, this king of wands is like holding on to you. Yeah, the knight of pentacles. To, what is this king of wands? Or, or something like that. Yeah, the hangman. Or something, they're waiting. Or, yeah, the eight of cups. The Nine of Pentacles and the Six of Swords. Yeah, we have the Ace of Pentacles. An opportunity, new stability. That's come out in your other reading very heavy. This could be regarding your career with the Emperor. You have the, you have the Eight of Cups and the Nine of Pentacles. Whatever moves you're making or whatever you're starting. What's this Ace of Pentacles? What is this? Yeah, this is going to make you very happy with the Ten of Cups and the Fool. Yeah, dream chaser, risk taker. So whatever you, you're thinking about doing, taking a risk here, doing something, investing in something, you're being very strategic. You need to do it. It's your calling with the judgment. You're being called to do something, awaken, awaken these creative and um, ideas that you have, put them into to, um Put them into fruition. Do them. Yeah, the star. Because it's going to, yeah, the, the, in the Ten of Pentacles and the Page of Wands. So good news is here. 
This is, yeah, the Ace of Swords. This is this idea. Yeah, the Fool. I'm seeing it. Happy and the Ten of Cups, the Fool. Take this risk is what, what, what Spirit is telling me to push to you to say. The Ace of Pentacles, what's the star in the financial success with the Ten of Pentacles and Page of Wands? Really good news coming in here. Yeah, this is your justice. Okay, Libra, there it is. There you are, truth exposed or some kind of truth, yeah, the, or some kind of truth or clarity being given to you here. Seeing something from a different perspective. Yeah, you are a leader. You're strong-willed here with the King of Wands. Powerful, doing your Two of Wands, focused in decision. You can't make a wrong decision here. That's the Two of Wands. Very good choices, Ten of Cups, that you're going to be happy that you made. Or a leap of faith or risk you took, you're going to be happy you did that. Okay, justice is here for you. Spotlight, Six of Wands and the Emperor. Your career is about to pop off. There's a lot of money. Ten of Pentacles next to the Ace. A lot of security and stability here for you. Someone could be jealous or mad about it or angry or upset. Who gives a fuck? Okay, you need you need to you need to keep working. Yeah, the seven of wands in the tower. Damn, something is a major backfire, unexpected upheaval and defensive. What is this unexpected? Yeah, the five of cups, regret, lonesome. Yeah, so so somebody was expected to cause some kind of upheaval or loss or something in your life or something like that. What is this seven of wands type? This is like a major backfire here. Okay, major, like instantly. It could be a Scorpio. Somebody's in regret here or something blew up in somebody's face. Yeah, karma and destiny, the will of fortune. The table's turned on somebody. This looks like karma, justice in the will of fortune. Like real bad. What is this? That take yeah, the page of swords, gossip and spying. Now somebody's watching you, stalking and, and, and everything. It could be a Virgo. What is this that's going on? Seven of Wands, Will of Fortune in the Tower with the with the lonesome card. Seven of Wands, Will of Fortune in the Tower with the lonesome card. What is this energy? What is this backfire? Wow. Yeah, we got the death card. So this could be a death or transformation or a change. Or, or something or something somebody tried to cause upheaval or a major change in your life but it but it didn't quite work like that yeah the five of swords somebody's doing something malicious it's a Scorpio somebody tried to cause this major change or do something here to you but it, it only backfired and fucked them up now somebody's depressed or going because the death card in reverse could be like bankrupt or depressed or 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 being fucked up or something like that. But I'm getting a heavy Scorpio with the tower and the um death. It could be an Aquarius here as well. But now they're in regret here. Or there's going to be a loss. Yeah, that, that was confirmation that dog barking. Yeah, the five of swords because somebody did something real fucked up. Yeah, the three of swords or malicious to try to hurt you. These two cards are together is to try to hurt you. Yeah, the, the higher fine. It could be a Taurus, an institution, somebody you're married to, a conglomerate or something. Yeah, the trap card, eight of swords that try to trap you or sabotage you. <laughs> But it backfired majorly. Seven of Wands Tower, I'm getting majorly. Something about the weather as well. Yeah, this ain't going to happen like this. Somebody lost the Five of Cups. It, it was a fail. Um, Yeah, yeah, the Eight of Cups. Elevate and move on. Nine of Pentacles and Queen of Wands. You're still confident, Emperor, and you're doing your thing in your career. I'm just getting it's just not going to work or it just did not work. Yeah, the, yeah even the Four of Cups is here. It's like a no-go. I'm getting your stability because somebody not now someone's worried. Yeah, the nine of swords. Now someone's worried because their their intentions have come out with fear and hitting in the reverse. Uh, it's a heavy Cancer or a Scorpio, or somebody with those placements could be a um could be a um fire sign as well. But whatever. Okay. Yeah, we have Knight of Pentacles. Something just did not work, or somebody try to get blinded and confused. It's a lose lose. Somebody's confused. They don't understand why this work. Why is it working? Why is it backfiring? Or why did the tables turn? Or how did you turn the tables? Or whatever. Yeah, you're getting justice here. What's the Ace of Swords and the Justice with the um, Two of Wands? Yeah, the King of Pentacles. Yeah, I'm definitely getting in your money. Somebody has been stealing your money. Also, again. Keep track of everything. Keep track of all receipts, all everything. Whatever this conglomerate, corporation, Taurus, uh, Scorpio, or whatever is trying to do to you, affect your money, steal your money, your tips, your money, anything that belongs to you. Keep track of every motherfucking thing because I see you winning a huge lawsuit here in the future. All right? So 
um, or this could be several people. Somebody is trying to do something or trying to set you up with a lawsuit or trap you. They don't have nothing on you. They're just trying to find any fucking thing to sabotage you and end you or put it in. They're working with the police or do something. You have nothing to fucking worry about, especially being the justice, bitch. It's just not going to happen like that. And especially because you're not doing anything. Somebody's just hateful, nasty, jealous, and wicked. And, and it's backfiring on them real, 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 real bad. Somebody was doing spell work or black magic on you. You dead at that shit. Or your ancestors did. Yeah, the six of swords in the world is over. You're going to be guided away from this. Your guides are always going to protect you. Cycle complete. Somebody trying to do this to you. The six of swords transition in tranquility. You're moving on. Yeah, the um, just period. What's the king of pentacles and the justice with the two of wands? You're making really good choices in your career. Like your guys want you to know that. Yeah, you, you are doing very well here. And you're going to continue to impulsive knight of swords. So I'm getting you're, you're taking your time to really be strategic here. Yeah, the healing. So this is a time to sit back and wait. Just wait maybe four days or so. Before you, you jump into something, just plan it out well with the two of wands because something's going to work out for you anyways. Focused in decision, someone, something's going to work out for you no matter what. You're going to have what you deserve. Yeah, there you are, Libra, Queen of Swords, self-sufficient and upfront. And I'm getting you to speak the truth too. You're also getting rewarded by the universe for doing exactly what you're called to do with the judgment. That's your calling. And the Ace of Pentacles is your North Node. You're speaking your truth, doing what you do, or whatever this is, you're, you're, you're going to be rewarded for that. Somebody try to trap you, stop you, hinder you, or do whatever the fuck this is, they're going to pay for that. Because I feel like, yeah, three of cups, people somewhere, yeah, the devil, somewhere um, celebrating or laughing, and now they're not no more because that shit done backfired. Now they're in the five of cups energy, looking stupid as fuck. Let's clarify a little bit with this one. I just wanted to do two readings for you, Mother. Um, be careful with my Gabriel. Okay, what is this over here somebody tried to do? Because, I mean, the Seven of Wands Tower came out together. Like, it flipped out perfectly together. That's a backfire, a no, a blow up in your face, or whatever. Yeah, the Seven of Cups. Someone's confused. Seven of Swords and the Tower again. And the Wheel of Fortune again. Like, look at this, man. The same cards are coming out. Look at this. Somebody is confused. Sevens are warnings, too. Somebody was warned to stop doing this. Now shit's going to pop off. We got the Five of Pentacles. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune, again, that's, that's turning the tables. That's also the karmic wheel. What goes around comes around. And you have justice here, too. That's karma. Somebody trying to set you up with a legal situation, have you trapped or stuck or set you up or have you fucked up or keep something from you that's rightfully yours, your money or your, your <clears throat> tips, patronism or whatever this is. Somebody is confused. They're mind blown with the tower and the seven, and the seven of cups or a Scorpio. How you keep f figuring this out. They keep trying to trap you, set you up, have you fall in this trap. But the seven of swords always gets caught. So somebody, yeah, the eight of swords come through spirit and the ten of swords. Someone keeps trying to sabotage you and set you up, Libra. The ten of swords, but it keeps ending abruptly or it's just not happening like that. Somebody is angry. Like, why the fuck does this keep happening? Three of cups, lovers, two of cups, ace of wands. Somebody does want to reconcile here with you as well. They're like, why is this happening? They're angry. That's your you, that's your guides. Your guides are always going to find a way to, 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 to make sure you do not fall into these traps because it's being done for nothing. It's being done for just to be evil. What is this person doing right here? Yeah, it's the temperance. Divine intervention is going to be every time. Our angel, Michael, your angel, they are here. They protect you. What is this right here? What is this, this evil energy? Yeah, your guides come in and they protect you every goddamn time. Yeah, it's a cancer. Yeah, it's the or it's, or it's the police. Trying to set you up, sabotage you. Yeah, the eight of cups, that's moving on. Might have, like, no. It's not going to happen like that. The chariot of the eight of cups. It's just not going to happen like that. This is the police, the justice system. Somebody's trying to get you caught up with it. It could be a cancer, a hateful, nasty, nasty racist, loser, fucking cancer. Just period. A loser with nothing better to do but be a hateful prick. Yeah, just period. Or this conglomerate. Yeah, the higher font and the two of swords. Something is just a no. What's the higher font and the two of swords? Could be a Taurus, a Cancer. What's this higher font in the two of swords? Something is a fucking no. 
And I feel like, yeah, the Four of Cups is a no. And the Two of Pentacles, it just keeps going back. Yeah, the Nine of Swords. And yeah, someone's angry, the Knight of Swords, because they, it keeps coming back on them. The, yeah, the Nine of Swords, the World, and the Five of Cups. And the justice, I, I wanted to know what the nine of swords, five of cups in the world is, the justice. You're going, it's going every fucking time. Somebody's trying to do something to you, your child, your life, your money for what, man? For fucking what? Yeah, the, imp oh, this is why, because you're the empress. All right. So let's see, what's the empress? You're the empress, you're beautiful, creative, you're strong, you're powerful, you're progressive, you're, you're, um... Oh my gosh. I just, I don't know. Yeah, we have the emperor. Wow. So your divine counterpart, what's this? I'm not going to make it too much longer. What's the emperor and the empress? But we have the two of cups here. So this could be, um, yeah, three of pentacles. You're going to be working with somebody or or something like that. Yeah, the, um, the five of pentacles, knight of pentacles, three of swords. So some, what's the emperor? Show me what this is. Emperor, empress. Yeah, the Ten of Cups, and it fell out in the upright. There it is. So you're going to be happy here, or you're working with somebody. Yeah, the Eight of Wands, something is progressing here. I see you working with somebody. Yeah, or working on something. Yeah, the Three of Wands, and we have the Ace of Swords. Or or you could look forward to this. Yeah, this could be about your, um, your money or your finances or something like that. Let me see. Yeah, the Ace of Swords or the Six of Pentacles and the Three of Cups. Okay, what is this? Eight of Wands is progression. Yeah, the Six of Swords. You could be relocating here, or your or 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 something is perfect. Yeah, the Page of Cups, the Knight of Wands, and the Knight of Cups with the Sun. I'm definitely getting a fire sign or a water sign that's wanting to come in, apologize, or say something. You're like, man, I just it's, I'm just over motherfuckers coming for you, Libra. I'm over it. Yeah, the Star card. You're pulling that again, the Ace of Wands. Again, this new idea, endeavor. You're being called with the judgment, Ace of Wands and the Star to, to do something here. Yeah, the Nine of Cups. You're going to get your every wish is going to come true. You're going to get what you deserve because you are a good person. You're not doing anything to anybody to deserve to be constantly attacked. Now someone's worried about it. They're fighting. Yeah, you're going to be protected. The Seven of Wands and the Devil. You are protected. Maybe even by the same devil these bitches call on to do shit to you. Because people don't understand the devil is enamored with the with, with Venus. Um, Saturn is, is is enamored with Venus. Mars, Scorpio, and um, Aries energy is um, enamored with Venus. So the same devils you call on to do work on them and to, to do it, they turn on you for the Empress. The Empress is highly favored and covered and protected. Not only are they the, they embody every queen, they're the most beautiful, the creative, but they also are the justice and scales. Just period. And it's not, it's not, yeah, the Ten of Wands, Five of Cups, somebody keeps trying to do something to you. And it's going to be blocked. It's going to backfire every fucking time. It's a Capricorn, a bad, wide-built body stank-ass one that keeps trying to come for you. What's the Seven of Wands? Or somebody's trying to record something or catch you saying something or, or, or take something you to court for saying something or whatever. The judge is going to laugh at this person's in this person's fucking face. You do not have a case. You are building something simply off of whatever. Someone's trying to get a protective order or set you up, trap you with the police. It's just not going to work. It's going to be a fail every motherfucking time. Just period. What's the Empress and the Eight of Wands? So keep, yeah, the sun. You're going to be very happy here. The fool, you are free and, and, and go after your dreams or whatever you want. Yeah, the Three of Swords. Yeah, we have the Two of Cups here. What's the Three of Swords? Yeah, the Four of Swords. So you're going to rest easy. If somebody betray you or whatever this is, Libra, you know, um, you're, you're going to get over it. Okay, or this is an ex that's wanting to come back in or something like that or somebody or something. What's the three of swords? Well, yeah, the, the ten of pentacles. Yeah, your skills. Yeah, the confident. Yeah, the, that horn beat when I said ten of pentacles. And the ace of pentacles is here again. A lot of abundance. So you will heal. Somebody betray you or try to set you up. That could have hurt you here a little bit. But the three of swords, that's your energy, Libra, but it's a minor arcana. So it's not going to last. Four of swords is your energy, too. You're going to heal and move forward. I feel like it's, it only take you three days and you over it. Full card. You're like, man, whatever. Okay. 
because because you're just not meant to be held down or blocked or hurt. It only hurts you because you are a genuine person while other people are grimy. They're always trying to do something. Libras rule open enemies. They're always trying to do something wicked to you and you come from a genuine place, okay? This reading could be a confirmation or somebody could be wanting a reading from you or you predicted something or somebody loves your readings if you're a reader. Ace of Swords and the Magician. You're going to get a confirmation. In two days, you're going to see confirmation of your work, of your power, of, of, of just you okay the empress your highness you're beautiful and this is male or female empress she has the five of wands that's wanting to flip out here in the reverse and the seven of pentacles in the reverse. Yeah, the magician. Somebody's shit just not working. Yeah, the magician, two of wands and the four of wands. You did something right on time. You made a good decision and, and you handled something. Yeah, the magician is manifesting. So I just feel like no more energy putting in, walking away, giving up or something because somebody's not going to be able to do this to you. So they might as well. It's just not going to go like this. Somebody's holding your, somebody's holding your motherfucking money block, uh, or, or, or whatever they try to do here to sabotage you, get you in jail, set you up or do anything like that with the police. It's going to backfire instantly so bad. And I feel like it's going, it's, it's just going to be bad. I'm, I'm just going to say that. I'm just period. Somebody try to cause um, or, or, or they're trying to do something wicked to you. It's just not going to work. Yeah, the ace of swords, whatever you did here, it's, it's, it was a good decision. All right. Whatever you do, um, you did, yeah, the pay, you're going to get a solid confirmation, a solid one, okay? Something is going to backfire or, or whatever this is. It's just, it's, you're protected. Your home is protected. Every, your money is protected. Everything is protected. You're going to be good. Yeah, four of pentacles, four of wands is protection. You're going to have that. There's an opportunity, a very lucrative one that is coming in for you. Yeah, the strength card and the lovers and the two of cups. Wow, somebody's deeply in love with you, a, fair, a deep connection here, or this is you or, or something like that. Yeah, the temperance. It could be with the Sagittarius, the perfect blending of energies, all right, or something. But the overall energy here is the nine of cups. I didn't even notice that. We have the nine of cups and the sun. So getting what you want. Getting exactly what you want. I, I feel like somebody could be trying to, to, to dead that. Yeah, I'm getting something you're going to have to let go of. But, but you're moving on, okay? Because something better is here. Yeah, the, the magician, the five of wands. Someone keeps trying to do chaos magic and, and, and cause endings and shit like that. Okay, let's see. What What is this evil energy here? What is this wicked? I'm, I'm, I'm going to get it from my deck. Yeah, that's where I need to go. What is this wicked right here? Yeah. That somebody to sabotage and set up. Somebody's trying to do to the empress, to justice, to the scales. And they're failing misery. is backfiring and shit like that. I lost my house, car, and job. I'm working on you losing yours. So someone's going to lose everything here. Or someone's trying to get you to lose yours. Suffering from a fatal illness. Um, and then we have working hard every day to make your life miserable. Yes, yeah, somebody wants to set you up, trap you. If I can't have you, no one will. So you don't want somebody, you block them or rejecting them, so they're doing this. Yeah, I'm manifesting illness within myself by constantly attacking you. What's this for the, um, and yeah, I project failure and fear on you on a daily, yeah. Okay, it could be a Sagittarius. Yeah, I know I should stop, but I'm obsessed with destroying you. Somebody's aware of this. I'm obsessed with you and I watch your home. Someone's watching your home. I don't believe in karma. I am God and the devil. And that's why God is going to introduce himself personally. Filing false police reports on you to set you up. Didn't I say that? Somebody's trying to set you up with the police. Filing false police reports. Lying. They're trying to do anything they can or get anything on you that they can. Just to, yeah, I will go to any extent of low to win. Just to beat you or see you down. They're doing blocking spells and all kinds of shit. Trying to hack into your car. Trying to hack or see something. Somebody is obsessed with destroying you. This is pathetic. Yeah, somebody's like, I will conquer and break you by any means. Somebody's obsessed with trying to set you up. I can't wait to see you come to your demise in reverse. It's just not going to happen. Yeah, Capricorn got that in there. So it definitely could be a Capricorn or somebody with those placements or a cancer or whatever this is. Somebody is determined and you're going to pay for that. This Scorpio Sagittarius, you're wicked, dog. And you're going to pay for that shit so bad. 
Like it's going to, it's going to be unbearable. We have, I'm doing blocking spells on you on a daily. Yeah, divinely protected our angel, Michael, ancestors and guides. They are here for you, Libra. What's divinely protected? Our angel, Michael, ancestors and guides. Look at that, chosen. I swear to God, I can't make it up. Okay, handpicked by the heavens. If I can't have you, no one will. And I manifest the illness within myself. Okay, I have a possession of yours. I'm doing spare work. Okay, let's see. You're chosen, handpicked by the heavens and divinely protected. It's just not going to happen. You're too favored and covered and chosen. That's why the judgment is there twice. We have bounty hunter, chaser, hot pursuit. Somebody's on your ass. Yeah, drastic, extreme, harsh cutoff. So this could be somebody you cut off or excommunicated. A fire sign with this with this stick in this dog's mouth. Somebody's on you. Yeah, must have indulgent and obsessed with you, divine masculine. So this could be your yeah, love and pop up. Someone's going to pop up on you, unexpected, surprise. They love you, this divine masculine energy that you cut off or blocked or you got rid of. Yeah, offer on the table, commitment. Somebody may even want to propose and we have insatiable, unquenchable and wanting more. Somebody's obsessed with you. Realization, awareness, finding out and coming to light somebody's realizing how much they're in love with you Libra or this is you or how much they want to be with you or whatever yeah closed in trapped and frustrated someone could be frustrated because whatever they're doing isn't working yeah reminiscing rem um, memories and returning okay yeah we have trapped um closed trapped in and frustrated you're not trapped or any of that yeah retaliation punish payback and revenge somebody wants to try to um pay um um uh, they, they want revenge for something someone's holding on so cappies and cancers Capricorns and Cancers, they hold on to the past. And Scorpios, they're vengeful and hateful. And they want to do something to you. you I, I'm getting you to even do nothing. Yeah, we have wish, hope, yearning, and today, present, now, and focus. Someone's watching you like a fucking hawk. And someone may pop up on your ass today and say something or something like that. But somebody's wishing and yearning for you, Libra. Like, yeah, rescue others involved. Okay, yep. So, it's people involved. And then we have spiritual awakening, a season. Yes, a, so, yeah. Ascension is here. Or someone's having a spiritual awakening and they're realizing something or something like that. Yeah, meeting. So they want to meet with you. Discuss something here. Unconditional love and happiness and twin flame. So this could be a twin flame that has this unconditional love for you. They're, they're happy or whatever. Okay. So we have the lovers here with genuine love and certain love here. And then behind it is twin flame and happiness. So someone's realizing how happy you make them. They're in love with you. They're regretful or remorseful for what they did, how they treated you. It was for no reason. Or, di or this is you. Or these people are going to or whatever. Okay? So those are your messages, Libra. I love you. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, and follow. And I'll see y'all the next time.